Hi guys, welcome back to Red Dog Gaming where we are continuing our campaign as Parthia in Rome Total War Remastered and as you can see we have a great empire, a massive empire at this point, the whole of the eastern side of the map and we're going to continue going steaming through uh, the Romans and the Macedonians, hopefully not the Dacians because that's just another uh, theatre of war that we don't quite want to open yet. Um, but yeah, doing all right. It's doing quite well. Um, I have played this episode already, but it was quite a few days ago, um, and unfortunately, I forgot to record. Um, so we're back here at the start of this episode. But honestly, I don't remember anything that happened because it was about two weeks ago now. Um, but yeah, we're doing all right. Where were you going? Are you going to Alexandria? Maybe. There we are. And you're going to Thebes. Thank you. Do want to get rid of these armies. Just because they're going to be annoying. They're probably trying to take Siwa. Um, over here, we've got Athens. We only have two hillmen. That is quite a big issue. Uh, Rams. Yeah, we'll go for Rams. Problem is, they might get burnt. So they might get burnt to pieces. Which is not ideal. We're retraining these guys here, which is awesome. Right, you're doing just fine. Um, hmm, you're getting retrained. And you are on your way to Vic Vicus Venadi. I remember that Scythia had like five settlements still, which seems absurd. That means they've taken German territory. Um, and obviously, they can't have anything east of here. Uh, but no, I don't know. Weird. Right. Hmm. Done everything we need to do apart from move these guys. You're only one star general, but you're 35 as well. Hmm. Not ideal. That's why we're bringing you across. You're 31, though. Hmm. Quite old. Okay. Cool. <laughs> Good luck, Namidia. Don't think you're going to win this, bro. Not going to lie. Very, very unlikely. Hugely unlikely, in fact. Yeah, so, uh, yeah, this is going well. Just done a couple of uh, Third Age Total War videos, so if you haven't checked that out, do check it out. It's good fun. Probably the best mod, well, not probably, it definitely is the best mod, best in-depth overhaul mod for Total War of all time, if not the best mod of all time for Total War. It's unbelievable. What, what they've done with uh, the Medieval 2 Medieval 2 engine really when you consider it but yeah we are here in Rome this is you know Rome is the game that I know a lot more about I know a lot more uh, in terms of the way to play them I guess you would say um, how to play the factions how to play most effectively come out with the lowest losses but then again it's not the hardest game in the world third age is definitely a lot harder you know Parthia is not a pushover start either but again it's you know it's not too hard to start on the other side of that we've got skirmish mode on take it off uh, Saluk I'd say Seleucids is probably the hardest start really just because you're so spread out, you can't really recruit very good troops, and you've got a lot of enemies. Egypt starts going ham on you. Like, that's that's the big issue. Egypt going ham on you right at the start. And, and their armies are trash, as we've seen in this campaign. But even in this campaign, when we, uh, we got to Egypt, we were relatively large. Not, not large, but we weren't tiny. And even we struggled with a few of their armies. Not not struggled, but you know it was a lot of troops all at once. Come on, guys, keep firing. They do knew what to do. Should probably speed this up. Get away. Yep, that's the general dead. Was he a proper general or what? I can't even remember. Now he's dead anyway. 
We've lost a few troops. Not many, though. There we are. Fantastic. We lost seven. Oh, well. Yeah, as you can see, horse archers being powerful once again. Who would have known? But especially against the Numidia team, they're not very well armoured and, you know, they're trash. Numidia is the trash faction. Um, we'll go after you. Hmm, do you have mercenaries here? Could probably just take these guys down with mercenaries, but I'm not too bothered. Um, let's get one that's a bit damaged. You can go across. Um, you go up there. Probably should have used you to, to replenish the rest of the units, but, but we'll do that in a sec. Good commander. I think that's everything. Just check we're building everywhere that we can. Come with some I'm guessing we can't. These ones, yep, fine, fine. And we're under seat. Oh no, Corinth is just dying. Unfortunately, plague minus 10. That's a lot, isn't it? Hello Macedon, welcome back. We're kind of split here, that's that's one issue. Um, we're split between Macedon and Scythia, and the Romans. But to come protectorate, uh, no. Stupid. Stupid idiots. I can't believe, <sighs> plague, we really need the plague to end here. We need some health. We don't really have any health buildings, though. Mm, no. They didn't build any either. It'd be nice if they built, like, sewers or something. Keep going with that, though. We'll keep sieging down Athens. And we can move these boys out now. So go take down Macedon. You get in there. They could probably siege down there if they wanted to. Siege down Larissa, but mm, ain't no bother of mine. You there, you keep going. You guys come into here, get retrained. So we need, we're getting one more. So we need one, two, three, four. We need four more of these boys. We're getting a blacksmith, so we might as well upgrade, uh, retrain everyone as well. Um, so two here, two there. That's four. Fantastic. Yep, cool. Trade increase, faction announcements. No worries. Oop, what's... Yes. Come on, get these elephants to the front line, my friends. Nicely got their nice uh, little armor upgrade and everything as well. Cataphracts one turn, so we'll get you up here. We get the cataphracts to join you. Fantastic war elephants. Do we have any? Uh, we got some on. Do we have any on the boats over here, or is it in here? Oh yes, look at that. That is a great army. Um, Antioch. I think we can recruit cataphracts now. Yeah, let's get a couple more then. While we're waiting for these troops to come over. Um, and seed on. Yeah, we're getting more of those boys. We are going to have a lot of armies. Rhodes, I really don't want to assault that city with one unit of infantry. We've got some hoplites. Oh, wait, they will attack us at some point, so isn't too much of a worry. Sardis. There's quite a few. Uh, two more there. Let's keep on going though. Make sure we get enough. Uh, we'll move you six across because that's where you need to go. Right. We really need to wait till Corinth survives. There you are. That's where you want to go. Yes, let's block these guys from getting into the city. Then they'll probably attack us, which will actually be good, I think. There we are, fantastic. Nice. Scythia will fall soon, I can feel it. Fantastic. 
Um, put this into you. You need to go attack those boys. You're attacking Athens. Hmm. There's just a big problem with attacking these walls at the minute. I think we'll leave them one turn. If they want to come and attack us, they might think they're strong enough, and they're not. But that's good for us. And we'll deal with the construction report soon. Right, let's go. Yep. Let's kill some more Numidians. Fantastic. Yeah, we're going to be in Carthage very soon. Very soon. Well, when I say very soon, there's a few, <laughs> there's a few several ones to take along the way. Might have to send up another army that way uh, when we actually do start fighting Carthage because, by God, they're a lot harder to fight than um, Numidia. But, does Carthage, yeah, the other question is, does Carthage exist still? Um, because Scythia, the Scythia, uh, are generally pretty strong early game sorry Scythiae Scipiae <laughs> um, uh, one of my favourite nations to play honestly I like fighting Carthage it's great fun more fun than fighting the Gauls did Julia have the most iconic intro and opening uh, come back a bit boys oh, we're right up against the map boundary Yeah, they ain't gonna do nothing. We're gonna come up here. Try and get closer, boys. Yeah, they don't know what to do. Um, yeah, I love playing Skippy, uh, the Skippy Eye. Now, <clears throat> Breach Eye is fine, but I've always tended to like when I play Julie Eye or Skippy Eye. Is go and take Greece anyway because it's such a rich area. Take it at the start. That's a top tip for you guys. Um, just take Greece. If you're a Roman, go to Greece. The Brutii generally take their time. So you should be good to go and get it um, early game. Just send like a, an army over, a half stack. Your, your infantry, although head on with a phalanx, find it hard. They're so much more manoeuvrable, so much better in general. Let's run. Yep. Kill basically them all now. Getting that XP. Fantastic. I think that'll be it. Yep. They killed one. I don't know how. Probably a stray javelin. Hmm. Weird. But yeah. Brutii are fine. I, the problem with... I can't remember which one it is. It might even be fixed in the remastered. But in the original, one of them didn't have a law-producing building. Um, a law-producing temple. Which, late game, a law-producing temple is incredibly important. Especially, like, look at... Right, we'll look at Thebes. I don't know what it's going to be like. It might completely... So look at this corruption. Distance capital, 390... That's why we're getting um, the secret police HQ, because it produces a law, which reduces corruption. But yeah, it's uh, late game. This is mad. This is huge. And that's we're not even that far away from the capital, considering we're down here. We could be all the way over here. Imagine the corruption. So without that law producing thing, you, you'd lose out on a lot of money. But, I mean, late game money isn't really an issue, so I guess... It's not that big a, big a problem for most uh, most campaigns. Yeah, come on, Corinth. Don't be upset. There we are. Perfect. 85 now. Let's go fight these boys. If we can. We've got a blister and a general. And then some Hastati and that. Oh, well. Oh, well. We will spread the plague to you and you will die, my friends. <laughs> oh yeah, I really like this game. It's great. I, this is by far the, get, the Total War game that I'm best at. I mean, I'm pretty pretty decent at Napoleon and Empire, but uh, they're not. Not quite the same as this game because every army you face is pretty much the same. 
um, same type of units. This is why these like medieval and Rome are so popular in, well, in my opinion anyway, you might completely disagree with it. Um, I don't think we need to split them this time. Um, but basically, you know, these, these types of games, they have a very, very large, varied uh, unit roster and um, faction. Same with Third Age, obviously, you've got completely different uh, styles of fighting. And then you start playing like Napoleon or Empire where it's, you know, you might face, in Empire you might face some Native Americans or something which is different or the Indian factions that are different, but pretty much Europe, like they're, you know, every army is composed exactly the same. But we don't want to get ourselves stuck on that rock. That's one thing we don't want to do. So let's do that. Uh, whereas like Rome, I mean it's it's because of the historical setting, obviously, but like Rome, the um, the factions are all so different. I mean, you've got these guys, horse archers. You go play Germania, and it is the opposite. There's, just, there's nothing similar about the faction at all. Like no similar units. Um, you play the Bretons again. They're, they're even, you know, the the uh, types of countries that are different. They have quite varied troop um, compositions. So like like Carthage and the Greek city states. Carthage was a uh, a Greek colony originally, if I'm not mistaken. So they're descendants of Greeks. Pretty different. I mean, Macedon and Greece, you could say they are pretty similar, but they do have different flavor, different different units. Um, the Romans are all the same, obviously, but they are all representative of Rome, just different families. Um, then you play like Parthia, completely different. Then Scythia would be completely different. Not completely different to Parthia, very horse archer focused, but the infantry is completely different. You don't get cataphracts, I believe. The more nomadic, yeah, you know, the flavor, including the buildings you can build, all that sort of stuff. Get to the later ones, everyone can build pretty much the same buildings. I mean, Warhammer, okay, I'll take that point. But I don't really, I don't really like Warhammer that much not played it that much i just don't like the engine on the new games is that just me or <laughs> good kill that ballista get that off get rid of all these boys we'll turn around to kill these start in that just need to kill as many because it was a small army to make it fully destroyed we need to destroy everyone there we are fantastic nice one boys and girls and well I don't know <laughs> we'll see um, I think what are the like nations like Egypt I know it's not historically historically accurate at all but completely different again chariot focused so you get such vi variety Hmm. Did play a lot of Napoleon though, but mainly because I loved the time the time period. Is this a faction leader? Oh no, it's captain. Whoops. <laughs> I thought it might have been the faction leader because it had fifty troops, but no, it's just cavalry auxilia, so not a general, which is good because generals are a lot harder to take down than these uh, cavalry auxilia. Better get back this way, boys. Or this way, if you can. I think we will just have time to just get out of there. We'll do a bit of friendly fire. The Hastati are getting absolutely destroyed. Probably time to bring up the cataphracts. Yes, there we are. Keep firing, my laddies. How many we killed? 55%. 45% we've killed. Still, they've still got a few to go. But these guys should fall pretty nicely. Oh, we can't actually get there, so let's get out of there quick. Mm. Some of this terrain is a bit, oh, janky, like that. Still firing. They're tired now, so they should be quite a bit slower, unfortunately. 
Well, how much ammo have you? Uh, how much armor have you guys got? No armor upgrades for them. No armor upgrades for these either. Surprising. You don't seem to be falling all that quickly. Okay, maybe not. Maybe I'm just not giving them a chance. No, we don't care about firing our ammunition. We just want to charge. Yeah, they're gonna. You're gonna charge a cavalry auxiliary into me? Like, whatever. It's not even a thing. <laughs> like, I don't care. I will shoot you to death. Have you not known this for much time? Well, I guess they haven't really fought us that much. Get into him. Kill those Roman archers. Fantastic. Oh, they've already broken, have they? Keep going. We'll try and get some XP. Um, oh, I grabbed the Hillman by accident as well. Guys, just stop firing. It's going to be too much friendly fire if you carry on firing. I think we will have done the job there. Yeah, they got less than 85, but it was two armies. Stop firing. You're firing at yourself. Uh, I think that'll be good. Fantastic. That's, yeah, fantastic. Nice. It's just steady away numbers there. We are getting this army quite experienced now as well, which is fantastic. Excellent. I mean, I've said fantastic about a fantastic amount of times. Uh, but yeah. We should do we should do well against the Romans now. They they haven't got any post Marium troops yet looking at it. Which is kind of shocking really. I thought they would. I think we'd leave those sieges. Siege is gonna be too hard. Yeah, I'm not scaling the walls there. I won't get over the walls. Here I might. Two Hillmen. Mm. Five Rams. Don't worry, we should get one of those. If not two. Destroys the walls a bit, but that's yeah, not no problem. You guys. Uh, no, we want you getting dropped off at Sardis, really. Sardis not able to get a port, or have I just not? I, it is. I wonder where it goes. Yeah, no, that's timber. Where does its port go? It's got to be somewhere around here. Like, there, maybe? I don't know. Weird one. This doesn't look like an obvious point for a port anywhere. Normally you see like a little fishing village. Oh well. Uh, now up here. Yeah, we're getting you moving. Great. Rhodes, Athens. Uh, who are you anyway? Cornelius Brutus. Yeah, cool. Let's end the turn. Oh dear. That's the ships with... If that's the ships with the elephants on, I'm a bit upset. <laughs> I think it is. I should probably move the other navies. Who do you want a ceasefire? I mean, let's have a look at your regions first. I request you give me. Tingi. Perhaps this Magna or. Yeah, Cyrene. I mean, I could pay for it. I'm at that point where I can just pay for any any places that they have. Do you know what? We should have used that. I should have shown you guys. I mean, most of you all know already, but how easy it is to buy settlements. Uh, well, hello. Might as well get rid of you. What are you? Egyptian chariots. I was hoping I wouldn't have to deal with any more of you Egyptians. Valhalka? You can jump on the boats with the elephants when they come. Cor Corinth is still dying. Fariel the Conqueror. Valhalka. You're extravagant, testy, and lively. That very much means that you're probably going to become a lunatic. Sorry, bro. It's going to happen at some point. Get up to there. Get these cataphracts on the boats. I could have sworn we get armored elephants as well, but it doesn't look like it. Susa is a large city, though. Let's have a look. Yeah, no, it 
looks like we just get war elephants. I think it's the Seleucids you, you have to get. Um, the armored elephants. Mm, what do we want here then? We should get that for law. Uh, yes, we forgot to do the construction last turn. Oh, oh, oh well. Uh, it's just one turn of building mist. We'll go through it this time. Yeah, Susa, Arctic Sata. Uh, just go for that. Katias. It doesn't really matter until you get upgraded, which is actually going to be soon. So let's get one that doesn't take long. Three turns. Yeah. Ankira. You're going to be upgraded soon as well. Nicomedia. You've just been upgraded. Fantastic. Um, execution Square for some law. Sidon. Get that built. Jerusalem. Just keep on going with the, the population growing buildings. Bet we, yeah, we are just ridiculously rich though now. It doesn't really matter what I build. Um, Themyscira. Hmm. Go for that. Campus Getai. Yep, keep that going. I know we'll go for the armor, but uh, it's going to take too long. Siwa. Fine. Larissa. I'm going to make you happy. You're just on the cusp at the minute. Oh, hello, Macedon. Get the rams. Many rams. Thermon's a large city. Wow. They've sat on that for a long time. What are you? You are, well, dead meat. That's basically the answer, isn't it? Um, yeah. Keep you moving. You are moving. How long left on roads? Four turns. Fine. Uh... You're a good navy. We'll get you so many rebel fleets. It's really annoying. Okay, you. That's actually good. You were just a ship. You don't have the elephants on board. You do. You need to get and go and get your uh, armor upgrades, don't you? I oh, know you've got them, but you need to. Uh, yeah, we need to split you among the the older uh, troops. Get two armies out of this. Uh, do we have any infantry? That's the one question. Not here. Hmm, scraps. Uh, we need some archers, really. Uh, here's the only place we can train archers. I think we might have enough, so... Let's go for four archers here. We'll get those guys out to the front line. One probably up this way. No, maybe not, actually. Everyone can be retrained now. Oh, no, I thought you would... I thought they would be able to with the armor upgrade. Oh, well. Doesn't look like it. Dacia, can you please not attack me? I don't think you win. And also, it's a bit dumb of you, really, <laughs> to be honest. We'll wait one more turn, get the rest of those guys in, and then we'll actually see if Dacia wants to attack or not. Disgusting. Right, we've got this battle to do. We'll probably do the Battle of Athens, and we've got these two battles to do. The, those uh, Scythians fucked off, didn't they? Come on then, boys. One ram. Let's go. We'll probably kill him very easily with the archers. May make him rout, which would be awesome. Yeah. We are spreading like a rash <laughs> from the east all the way to Western Europe. Um, I don't know when we're going to end this campaign. I, I think probably when we've defeated Rome, because at that point, you know, we're just, well, at the minute we're steamrolling everyone, including the Romans. Um, so at that point, it'd just be a case of steamrolling less armored troops, which would be so easy, especially with upgraded armies and elephants and all that good good stuff. God, we, we're a damaged, damaged force, aren't we? Very damaged. They don't have any missile troops and only towers over there and there which is a long long way away so oh god they decided to be a dickhead about it and not stand there for me to shoot i mean this guy would probably just defeat him well he would but come on get it done 
Why does he always say the battling ram, not the battering ram? Subtle difference. <laughs> yes, we have. Can you just go shooting? You can actually go through there. I always forget that. Just go here and just start shooting the boys. Get out here. Get out. Is that a general dead? Oh well. Ah. Uh, well, we took some casualties because I was playing on six speed, but. <laughs> <laughs> it's just one unit, so what are you going to do? Like, this army don't really particularly need to be too careful with it. It has a nice half-light unit in it, which I like. Um, I think we exterminate here. We're never going to actually want... Well, we're never going to be able to upgrade this place. Not by the time we finish playing. Um, very little unlikely. It is a town, but it's only 400 people now. Because we've smashed it to pieces. Um, also, yeah, do you not happy yet? Oh well, we have to get some. Uh... Okay, yeah, these are nice mercenaries. We'll take them all. Sixty percent. Uh, yeah, sixty percent without the general. I don't know. I, I think we can manage without. Um, uh, without a governor in there, I think it will survive. If not, we'll just have to re uh, retreat. Now, where's the next? So this is all, all part of that area. That's Germania. Surely that's the last two Scythian settlements. Like where else could they have any? It must be. Oh well, we'll go and we'll go and. Uh, Go to Sarosh, meet up with Sarosh, um, and then we might actually launch an attack on Dacia. I don't want to deal with Germania just yet. It's prefer to keep the borders nice and clean up here. Germania, you can worry about anything, everything else. Right, let's go. They have three uh, horse archers. We've got about seven, so should be easy again. Rattle through these small battles because we have big battles to fight as well. Got to kill that Macedonian force, and then we'll probably go. I think we'll go Byzantium. We have enough armies in the Greek um, peninsula to um, to fight off at Macedon if they want to take Thessalonica again. Horse archers. It says horse archers as well, which you can take the ram. You can drop that and fire at them okay no they're not gonna bring their horse archers forward are they not well that's annoying guess it's I guess we'll use these two guys can you even use the, the hillman when they're or, or are they eastern infantry not hillman should be firing on these boys pretty effectively okay just run in front of my archers why don't you <laughs> That has done them some serious damage. Get forward a bit. I think that's better. Um, right. They shouldn't run away because... Yeah, they shouldn't run away. Guys getting there. Hillman as well. Come on, boys. Are they running or is that cluster's running? <laughs> they seem to be going incredibly slowly. I know they're heavy cavalry, but you guys get into those boys. General's taking a bit of damage. Fire your missiles and then charge. Nice so I should so I should have even taken any damage yet. Take a little bit here. Okay. You boys should be able to fire now, they don't want to. General's routing, he's on the town square, right? 
get through to them. Uh, right, you boy. Okay, well, end the battle anyway. Lost 27, killed many. <laughs> I hope that's Scythia dead. It's nice to play uh, a game where, well, unlike Third Age, where if you get to the last settlement, they get Doomstack of pretty good troops. But surely that's got to be them dead. Let's exterminate again. Yes, thank you. Now they shouldn't be bothering us anymore then. Fantastic. They're unhappy in Vikas Venadai as well. But what can you do? Try to make them happy. That's it. Faction destroyed. Fantastic. Right. You're going to stand and fight. Are you. Good luck. That's all I can say, my friend. Good luck. Uh, I mean, I try not to be at war with too many factions right now, but yeah, it doesn't really matter, does it? Like, <laughs> the, the losses we take in field battles are so minimal, and the amount of troops we kill is so high, our KD is so high with these guys that we can, like, outlast anyone in a war of attrition. Quite a small map, this, actually. Well, no, it's very small. I don't know why. Uh, you boys of this side You guys stay back. We're not going to use you unless we have to You guys just gonna cramp them up big uh, big scary is their general um, But I think we'll be able to get away from him. He'll be slower. Is he an armored one yet or not? No, he's just still a general's just Still just a general's bodyguard. Standard bodyguard. Okay, that's a good position. Maybe even closer. Levy, pikemen, phalanx, pikemen. They do have the royal pikemen. We've not seen... Have we seen them in battle? I think we have seen them in battle, but... That's what they look like. Whoa! I never noticed that face before on their shields. Oh, that's pretty cool. I like it. Um, okay. Run. <laughs> This is a problem with having using two sides. You're going to micro a lot quicker. But. Oh well, it's what we sign up for, eh, boys? When you're playing a whole sort of faction, could be doing some serious damage to these boys now. And these royal pikemen. Let's get that way. Get down that way if you can. We'll move, rotate around in a very large Cantabrian circle. Very large. Come on, quick, quick, quick. Quick. I said quick. I hate when they do that. Just Why just stop? Like, you see the, <laughs> the enemy are charging you. Run away, will you? Be nice. Probably be a good idea as well. He doesn't know what to do, poor. What's it? Eugenus the Honest. Eunus. Eunus. Eunus? Eunice? Eunice the Honest? Eunice? I'll go with Eunice. That's the one that sounds best. Okay, doing some damage. Let's get over here, boys. Okay, it was just a glancing... Glancing shot, I guess you would say. A try. Okay, they, they're withdrawing, maybe. Don't want you in us to withdraw. Yep. Right, get get over there then. Yes, he's dead. Fantastic. We don't need to worry then. Yep, they're breaking. Wonder whether we can shoot them all. How many have they lost anyway? Still got twenty three. We do need to kill them all. Oh, I will go here right in front of where they're going to go. We might have to charge them. I might have to they might they might have to stop and try and fight us. It's up to them. 40. Oh, we should we should win then. I think that's that should be them dead. You lost 7. As I was saying about the KD ratio, that's the uh 
There's a proof seven for 534 or whatever it was. Very nice, very nice. And that's not even a too bad an army from the Macedonians. Obviously it's not a full stack, but it's not horrendous. Ollie, could you build a lovely watchtower here as well, please? So I can see these passes a little bit better because we're going to have to send troops up from Athens if they do attack. Ah, well, Macedon, looks like you picked on the wrong person. When I say picked on them, I picked on you, I guess. <laughs> right. Um, can these guys sap? That is one thing. They might not actually be able to sap, so I might have got those sap points for nothing. Mm. Let's just check. Do, do, do. They can sap. Okay, cool. We will sap the life out of Athens. Poor Athens has been through a lot. Taken by the Romans. Now time to be taken by us. Probably exterminated. <laughs> Sorry, Athens. Um... We're going to make you happy. Could enslave them? Um, I just don't f think it's really necessary anymore. It's not really worth it. Uh, I don't know, though. We could grow a few of our smaller settlements if we do that. Uh, so let's do it. Let's do it. should also keep on checking. Oh, should check the building browser. I forgot to do that. Um, not the building browser. Yeah, the, the building list. Just because I know I missed one of the turns where I was building. Yeah. Come on. You can do it. You can load the battle. I know you can, computer. Don't crash. Yes, here we go. Yeah, I can't, I can't wait to finish this. I can't wait to kill Rome. Look at this, though. Mm. Well, we will use one person on the ram anyway. You can go in the sap point. I'm tr th these walls look pretty hefty though, so... Kind of wondering whether I'll be able to fire all the way back here. I hope not. Get in there. Do I have one person on the walls? What are you? Just a Principes. Don't really need to worry about a Principes right now. About here, if you go here, can you? Can you? Oh, you don't actually do then. I think that ram's going. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, you should get in there. There, and we'll have two goes. Uh, we've got the. I think we're just going to shoot at the hillmen rather than the archers. So let's go forward if we can. Just to shoot the Principes, we're not going to be able to hit very many because they're behind the walls, but 72 is short at 72 on there. It doesn't look like, it looks like, it looks like half of them are stuck in the tower, really. They're not doing a huge amount of damage, is it? Um... We aren't going to be able to capture these towers, so we will be being shot by them the whole time. Which isn't ideal. I really do, with the Hillman doing some actual work in this, really. Work in this, this fight. Are you going to start destroying the walls, or what? Uh, how long does it take? Come on. Oh, there we are. I was going to say, it takes a while, doesn't it? Are you just going to stand on the wall? That's weird. Yep, they will. It's true. Not my blood, though. Oh, come on, Triari. I get yourselves out here. Oh. Nope. How much ammo? We've, some of them have actually used a lot of ammo. 
Uh, right. As usual, we've got to be pretty careful. So, hmm, send in these guys. These are quite experienced blokes. Like there. Send in you as well. And then you two come there. Um, then like the rest of you guys get back because <laughs> you're getting shot to pieces which is not ideal mm, cavalry auxilia they are um, about to get killed by my general don't do that because it's just not going to work in the city you guys, if you can, get there. All of you, quick, please. Get there. There we are. That works. Where are you? Just away. Well, you prink a face. We'll, we'll route them in one go. They can run through these bits, which is interesting because you wouldn't think you would be able to. How are you getting so killed? What the hell? Yeah, they're broken. Good. Right, now get out. Are these all the horse archers? Not sure. Uh, right. Best place for you would actually be here. If you can get there, my friend. Ooh, a Roman general. We should be able to beat the Roman general. It's not an armoured one. so And they should be being shot at. Hillman. We need to get up there. Just defend the area. Let's go. Come on, boys. Yeah, our horse archers don't stand a chance here, but... Try and charge the Roman general in the back. There we are. Yes, we're going to win this. We are getting shot by the towers, which is a bit of an issue. Get up there, boys, if you can. There we are. Fantastic. We'll come around this way. We can't. You should be able to shoot these boys now. Or is it Prinkapes and Cavalry? Oh. Can you get away from the walls, please. Get up here. Away from the walls. Like I said. You Hillman. You merry band of Hillman. Come on. Shoot these Prinkapes. And that's it. Is it? Hello, Triarii. Hmm. Oh well. Not doing a huge amount of dealing a huge amount of damage to these Prinker Bays. But where are you, General? General's gonna have a good time, aren't you? Get out, get out, get out. Uh, quickest way for you now to get into the town square is back around that way. You're going to get shot to pieces. Ah, oh, walls are so annoying in this game. Let's go, let's go. Charge them while they're like in that formation. That'd be brilliant. There go, before they throw theirs. Oh, that was brutal. Now out. just don't want them to fire their javelins at me. That wouldn't be ideal. You can fire the Triarii. Don't think they hit us with any of those javelins. Which is great. Oh wow. They did not like fighting the Triarii at all. 
counter charges, that's brilliant. We will destroy you. You should be dropping like flies. Not quite. Did do some good damage though. Do you not have any ammo? Okay, I was going to say. Your range, your range is actually quite big. Oh, get out of there. You're getting shot in the back, my friend. Um, uh, we don't want to send those guys in. They'll just get shot by the walls. Alright, let's go. One big charge. 16 versus 19 of them. We should be better off by far. Oh! Oh, well, one of them, one of our horses did die, but... Okay, enemy general fallen. Cornelius Brutus! Right, and let's just let the other guys shoot them to death. And we will uh, own the square, I guess you could say. Um, okay, Tree REI, if you want to try and break through, you can do. Where have they gone? <laughs> We're going to take the city, bro. You do realize this, right? Surely he's going to die. Someone hit him. Come on. Otherwise, I'll have to do this. Nice. Good luck, Tree REI. That's all I can say. You ain't getting there in time, bro. You can try. Keep our general here. Forty up tree REI. Captured in your own city, really. Yeah, Hillman are gonna take a bit of a beating, but Yeah, go on. There we are, fantastic. We did lose a lot of troops there. I have summoned a lot of the horse arch actually, but the hillman, it's mainly the hillman. Uh, luckily, we'll be able to retrain most of them, I'm guessing, here. It should have a barracks, at least, and a stable. That is, oh, that is the thing that makes the horse archers so OP as well. Like, they only take a stables to recruit. <laughs> it's kind of crazy, 30%. Um, extermination? We've got five that yeah they've got plenty of uh good barracks and all that stuff there get uh, we'll get a peasant um obviously to man athens while we're waiting um anyone else we need to move <sighs> not sure you guys you guys you guys yep uh why can't I control a all these guys? I don't know why. Uh, you get Sardis. Get your upgrades. Fantastic. Now let's uh, end the turn. See what happens. Are you going to blockade my port? Don't be foolish. Greetings. Oh baby, trade rights and map information. Oh, nice. Do you know what? Uh, what very demanding. We are by, by far the strongest person in this whole world right now. <laughs> oh, Dacia, you make me laugh. You really do. You really do. War with Dacia. Namidia, whatever. Campus Getai and Camp. You've just deceived with the one Falksman as well. What sort of fool do you take me for? Oh, another one in Antioch. Yeah, that's good though. We need. Um, another army ready here, really. Be great. How long are you going to take? Three, one, two, three, four, five turns probably. So we can keep recruiting these boys. Four more. And then they've got to move across anyway, haven't they? So that's three more. How many elephants do you have? Three. Yeah, we'll get one more elephant. City expands. Sardis. Great. We're not building here anymore either. I kept, I forgot to do the thing again. Campus Sarmatai. Uh, Katias. Brilliant. Still deaths. Ooh, Larissa now. Corinth, it stopped. And then Larissa, it started. Oh, my days. And they are incredibly upset with me. 
they've just gone from being happy to being really, really, really upset. Torturer, Rohan of Susha. You got a torturer, do you? Plus one, plus three to law. That's brilliant. That should reduce corruption a lot. Let's see. Plus one. I mean, oh, corruption's nearly gone here. Yeah, that's excellent. Devastation from these guys, though. Hmm. Do you know what? I don't care about them. Well, we should probably destroy them. We should do all the building first. Uh, what do we want here? Get that Grand Bazaar. That'd be awesome. Campus Sarkai. Um, go for the extra shipwright thing. Campus Solani. More growth, I guess. <laughs> Sardis, you're building that. Halicarnassus, doesn't matter, but that's most important. Thebes, hmm. Get that. Corinth. Law, definitely. Domus, Dorcas, Domus. House something house. I don't know. <laughs> Wish I knew what it meant. Are oh, they uh, actually reasonably happy now? Well, I guess that means we know that this is Dacia. We can go fight Dacia without... Uh, I mean, Germania, though, as I said before, them getting trade rights with us is normally actually an indication that they're going to declare war. I don't know why the AI loves doing that, giving you trade rights and declaring war a couple of turns later. Um, maybe after you've, you know, screwed them out of a couple of trades. <laughs> um no, I'm joking. Uh, we train. Some nice experience now in this army. Look at that. It's our attack 13. That is very strong. Very, very strong. Hmm. Okay, fantastic. Oh, yes. Let's do this because I'm an idiot and I keep forgetting to do it. Oh, my God. There's a lot of places that need to build. Well, good job. We've got a lot of money. Uh, Frasper. Get some more law. Seleucia. Hmm. More law, probably. Hatra. Law. <laughs> Everywhere, law. Antioch, though, actually something that's not law, probably. Oh, probably Scriptorium. Get our generals even better. Sinope. Uh, we'll go for that. Mazaka. Growth. Tarsus. More shipwrights. Muscus, no. Hmm, Tanias. More ship, more trading routes. Chersiones, better walls for law. Hmm. Bazaar. Thessalonica. Hmm, Thessalonica, what do we want here? It's an interesting one. Secret Police HQ, probably. Caedonia, get the roads. Just, just. I mean, I know it doesn't do anything because it's on an island, but do it just for the look. Oh, Athens, of course. Get rid of you. And let's build you. Fantastic. Um, Sparta. These guys have all got their upgraded armor now. Brilliant get you oh sorry you in there and they've all got their upgraded armor they don't need to go in there we have another couple of armies really ready to go here yeah that's good we'll get them ready next turn uh, next episode so thank you very much for watching guys thank you um, for watching this video and hopefully you enjoyed and hopefully I'll see you again on the next episode.